Hi guys, Anishal here. Um, welcome to my um, Sims 3 current household. Okay, it is getting game sound. Didn't sound like it was getting game sound for a minute. Is it recording? <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay, my um, Sims 3 current household for February um, 2016. Yeah, I forgot what year it was. <laughs> All right, so this is my founder, Clementine. Clementine Everett, named after Clementine from The Walking Dead video game. Um, she is... Where her traits are brave, loves the outdoors, inappropriate, hopeless, romantic, and friendly. I don't know why this game sounds really loud. Okay, um, to me, she's an adult. Her favorites are disco, fish and chips, and red. What are you trying to do with the bird? Oh, the bird's asleep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, let's see. She's in the science career. Yeah, level 4 science career, fertilizer, and now Looks like she's about to get promoted. Um, her skills are cooking, fishing, gardening, handiness, logic, and painting. Um, she has 50,000 points. And she's a genie. She's a genie. And I gave her the inappropriate trait because in The Sims 3, when you have that trait, you can take a sponge bath. Yeah, sponge bath. So that's pretty Aww. cool. Comes in handy when you don't um, uh -huh. have a shower. All right. Um, this is her. Did they get married? I don't remember. Um, no, they're just romantic interest. They never got married. This is her romantic interest boyfriend, whatever you want to call him. <laughs> Baby daddy. His name is Alonzo. He's an elder. He just became an elder. His favorites are indie sushi, sushi and sea foam. Um, his traits are good sense of humor, flirty, great cl kisser, commitment issues, and never nude. Um, he's unemployed because I'm not allowed to get him. This is um, house one. I think I made this house one. Yeah, Sims 3 Drifter Challenge house one. Alright, um, so that's it for him. This is my house to air. Zach Everett, <laughs> and um, if you follow me on Twitter, you may have seen some pictures because I haven't played them very much. We've well, I played them Mona. like maybe a couple weeks ago, but before that, it was like and last Zorba. year, I think, before I played them. But come out here, Zach. This is my um, house to air, Zach. I kind of made him like a little punky. He's like nerdy and punky. <laughs> he is, let's see, he's going to be an adult in four days. Brave, loves the outdoors, genius, gatherer. His favorites are green, mac and cheese, and classical music. Um, he's a A in school. Um, he has cooking, fishing, handiness, and logic and writing skill. And he is, is he a genie? He's also a genie. Um, this is our youngest, Nigel. Mm -hmm. Nigel. I just had him the last time. Um, what are you trying to do? Empty the potty? <laughs> Um, I just had him recently, like, the last time I played, I think, and he is also a genie, he's a toddler, he's gonna be a kid in three days, his favorites are classical, porcini, something, and orange, he's absent-minded and loves the outdoors. <laughs> And since I haven't really been um, keeping up with this family, 
Yeah, and he apparently he knows how to walk. Nifu. I forgot I taught him how to walk. Well, I don't think I taught him. I think he has the walker. Um, I haven't really been doing much with this family, so I just kind of, you know, the last time I played them, I just basically controlled oh. them all because... Oh, let's see, he ages up in how many days? Four days, so I don't think... I have the requirements. Um, what was the house requirement? 30,000 or 50,000 or something like that. And it's, um, let's see, it looks like 16 right now. And I only have like $6,000 because it's, this, Sims 3 is a little bit harder, in my opinion. Yeah, you can garden and you can fish and stuff like that. But as far as the collectibles, they're not as easy to. Um, get a hold of. You have to, like, literally run everywhere in town to get stuff done. So, they haven't been collecting that much. Phoebe Lele. They don't do... I think that's where you make a lot of your Corpia. money in the Sims 4 from collecting, and they don't really collect that much, and I forgot to set my timer. <laughs> so, go me! Um... We have a dog. Um, his name is, or is it a girl? Yeah, her name is Kia. We just adopted her, and she's almost an elder. Cause I wanted to get an adult instead of a puppy, so they could go learn to hunt and stuff. Oh, what a <laughs> Why are we bringing the baby outside? Okay. <laughs> and um, Nigel has his little imaginary friend. What did I name her? Lucky. I think I made it a girl because I was going to, um... If I still play with them, then that'll probably be a girlfriend. When he gets older. Um, we have a cockatoo. Our cockatoo's name is... What's your name, cockatoo? Storm. That's cool. Oh, we need to feed your food. Um, does Clementine need to work on her garden? I think so. Yep, harvest that. Ten garden. Alright. And he, I forgot to mention, he's a witch, right? Uh, yeah, he's a witch. <laughs> And he um, <laughs> likes to give, give himself the <laughs> love charm spell. So that's why their relationship is kind of weird. Because, like, is that what he's doing right now? No, he's just playing with it. He'll give himself the love charm spell, and if it, like, backfires, then the next time he talks to somebody, he becomes enemies with them. So he usually ends up talking to her, and they end up becoming enemies. <laughs> so it's like, okay. And I had her wearing, like, those ripped-up clothes. That came, I think they came with Supernatural. But um, I won this um, outfit. This is one of two outfits I've won from Club, Sim Club Simtopia. So I put that little dress on her. It's super cute. And I try to make him look younger by giving him like dark hair and stuff. <laughs> Did um, Kia learn how to die? Do you want to eat food? Are you getting it? Yep, a little bit. Do you have a... Yeah, you have food. You good. And I got one of those little swinging chairs. Oh, I didn't show you the house. <laughs> Do I want to show you the house? <laughs> it's a little scary. <laughs> it's a little bit scary, because I didn't do a very good job on it. <laughs> oh, what a mess. <laughs> Why did I do the roof that way there? And that must have been the part I added on. I don't remember. Let's go into daytime, so you can see. There we go. This is the front. Um, that's the... Well, this is the outside. I'm like, why am I explaining that? We're not in there yet. 
It's a little like loft area for my air. There's the back. And the wallpaper is ugly because I was using um, free wallpaper. So there's that. Then we'll come downstairs or upstairs or whatever. This is Zach's room. Well, it'll be Zach and I don't know if I'm going to give um, Nigel his own room, like change the nursery and just give him a bed or make them share a bed. I don't know. Or I might give um, I might give Zach the, the nursery because it's a bigger room and then give this one to Nigel. But yeah, there's bunk beds there. <clears throat> the only problem with this one is that, well, I can move the door, I guess. I can move the door to right here into the kitchen. This is, they have a bathroom. They have stairs going up to Zach's room. Not stairs, a ladder <laughs> going up to Zach's room. Um, this is their kitchen. They have a picnic table for a dining room. Um, her garden, I had to move it inside because of the weather. Ex well, except for the tree and stuff. I couldn't bring that in. But this is their room. Um, some flowers. What are those? Daisies. Yep, some flowers. And a bed and nightstand. Nothing big there. I just built, I just added this room. That's why it probably looks a little bit nicer than the rest of the house. He has a little dresser, a mirror. That is um, Zach's um, crown from when he went to prom. Little toy box. <laughs> so that's cool. <clears throat> I guess if I um, give Zach that room, then he can have the bunk bed. Because I put the bunk bed in his room because I was going to have the dog share the room with him, but then I remember the dog can't climb the ladder. So, yeah, that was dumb. <laughs> but I could probably give him this room and put the bunk beds in there, and the dog can sleep in there with him. And then I can move um, Nigel upstairs when he gets older. Oh, thank you for bringing your brother in. What season is it anyway? It's summer. One day until fall, 58 degrees. I have the moon set on waxing oh. gibbous, or however you say that. So that... Um, Stop you. So the zombies don't come out. Looks like Zach's ready for bed too. Oh, he's going to go eat. You're going to cook or get leftovers? Leftover birthday cake. Leftover birthday cake for the win. What do you want to do with your brother? Toss your brother in the air. Aww. <clears throat> dead special. What is this one doing? He's hungry, too. That's auto-solve. And if you didn't know this already, Sims 3 also had auto-solve. I found this out by accident. Because I was trying to click on something else, and I accidentally clicked their moodlet. So when they have like the hunger, bladder, energy, moodlets, mm. you can click on it, and they will go eat, or they will go to the bathroom, or they will sleep. Mm. Just like in The Sims 4, but it's not on their, it's not in their needs panel. It's in their moodlets. You like for his, like stop. <clears throat> so I'm going to cancel out his sleep. <laughs> I'll press the sleep button and he'll go to bed. Is he going to nap or sleep? And it's just like The Sims 4, you know, they'll, if you auto-solve, they'll probably just go take a nap instead of actually sleeping. But There's that. In case you didn't know. I didn't know. I found out by accident. Because I have a bad habit of not reading, like, directions and stuff. I like to figure stuff out on my own. So it might have been in the directions. But the, when when I got the game, I didn't have the, the game guide. I just had the little pamphlet that comes with the game. Oh, that plant oh. died again. I don't understand why the plants die sometimes. Which one is it? This one? Dispose of all dead plants. I think that one died, yep. I don't understand why they die. It's like you harvest them a few times and then they die. But let's do the dishwasher for them. Or no. You can drag it in the dishwasher, right? Yeah. I say, I thought you could. At least you can do more than one. Not like in the Sims 4, you can only do one. 
But it's alright, I guess. What's wrong with our puppy? Our puppy's hungry. Ah! The puppy's on the bed. No puppies on the bed. Come and eat. <clears throat> I don't think your bladder is low enough to pee. Nope. But you can get a toy. Is that a toy? That might be a toy. Yep. You can chew that toy. You can chew that toy. And they have a rocking chair, so his energy's pretty good. Oh, wah. Wah, wah, wah. Uh -uh. It was funny, I sold his wand and he ended up getting another one. <laughs> so I guess it doesn't do any good to sell it. Um, so she's asleep, he's asleep. He's just chilling in his crib. Is his genie bear in there or his imaginary friend? Yeah, his genie, because I think I put his genie bear in there first. I got him a little genie bear. Actually, it was his brother, so when his brother aged up, he gave it to him. Or actually, when he was born, because I think his brother was a teen, or he became a teen not too long after that. So he gave it to him. I like the little moodlet they get when they sleep with the teddy bears. Are you about to fall asleep? Yeah. And he's out. No. Aww. Don't go out. Um, so let's see what's up. Anything else going on? You're rocking. They love that rocking chair. It's all they do is rock, rock, rock. Where are you, puppy? I can't see my puppy. Oh, yeah, he's playing with this toy. He's playing with the toy, and the radio's on. We'll turn it off. Oh, yeah, you can't turn it off. There you go. So there's that. There's my little current household. With their ghetto phone. Because I um, turned off... Um, I turned off... What did I turn off? Um, university. The one that comes with the cool phone. Oh, so she can't even social network or anything, huh? Yep. Mm -hmm. Dang it. You're gonna go do guard your food. <laughs> what else do you need to do? I want you to go hunt and stuff. Can you go hunt? Guard the house. Be skittish. Run around. I don't know if his hunting skill is up enough. Maybe I gotta have, um, what's his bucket? Work with him. Uh-oh. What's the matter with you? You're hungry? But you're asleep, so you'll be fine. Why don't you teach him to hunt some more? Train to hunt. And we'll speed this up because it'll probably get boring. I guess he has to skill up. I thought he had already gotten a skill. I think they have what have to have what level one. So this little um current household has everything that we're missing from the Sims 4. <laughs> it has pets. It has toddlers. We'll get him up to the next level, and then we'll see if we can hunt. There you go. I'll breeze a dog and learn to hunt. I think he can hunt now. Let's see. You go to the bathroom. We'll get our puppy out here. Yep, sniff out collectibles. Cool. <clears throat> cool, cool. Um, is she awake? No. I think she's waking up. Yep, Clementine's awake. It's like 6 in the morning. Does she? I think she doesn't work on weekends. Huh? No, she doesn't work on weekends. Well, technically, she only works four days a week. She doesn't work on Wednesday either? Okay. I thought she only had two days off. Well, that stinks. So she only works three days a week. Uh-oh. What are they going to do? Berky nerve She's gonna flirt. I just woke up, but I'm gonna flirt with you. So spleen the mouth. <laughs> Pre oh, here's Pre something Zopa. else we don't have in The Sims 4. Why can't Sheba you? Uh, low. Oh, your relationship's too low. Ah. Tag. Of course Large. it is. 
Let's do a love charm mm -hmm. on her. Lena the Coney. <laughs> to get the relationship back Can't up. Wait. It's like Janja. it goes down and I have to put it back up. And then it goes oh. down and I have to put it back up. Wump Siebengorf. Tanaki. <laughs> But I didn't. <laughs> First chat. Your gossip. Shaka bra. Let's see if this gets the relationship back up, and then they can go woohoo in the shower. Yep. Yay! We can woohoo. So we have pets, shower woohoo, uh -huh. toddlers. Mm -hmm. ah, that was kind of weird. Mm -hmm. That was a little weird. Um, mm -hmm. After they woohoo, I will show you what town we're in. Mm. Yeah, we'll check. Sounds like the little one's sure. awake and he's probably going to start crying because he's probably hungry. Oh, we have alarm clocks in The Sims 3 also. <laughs> it's almost Nigel's birthday. Yay. Go, Nigel. Oh, you can get in there. Get in there. Nice shower outfit, dude. <laughs> shower woohoo! <laughs> oh, Kia found a gem. Nice. Good job, Kia. Good job. <laughs> Yay! Oh, apparently somebody wanted to do that, so that's good. Here, come take care of your son now. He's hungry. I know. But oh, she's already getting him. And see, that's another thing about The Sims 3. They actually take care of their babies. Even though The Sims and The Sims 4 are supposed to be smarter. Let's feed you before I forget. That's one reason I have the alarm clock going. So that I can um, remember to feed the bird. <laughs> okay, we are in Sunlit Tides. I kind of um, tried to move them where they weren't really next to anybody. I don't remember if that's an, a lot, but it's empty. And then that's the school. So they basically just live over here, and there's the the horse ranch thing, or whatever it's called. Yeah, on this area, there's no residential. It's all just um, community lots. And I wasn't about to delete them all, so they're all there. You just can't travel to them. I'm basically trying to do it like The Sims... Oh, he's cleaning it. Like The Sims um, 4 Drifter Challenge by Vahisha. Mm. Um, I'm kind of using those rules to an extent because some of the rules you can't really use. Oh, he's going to go potty by himself? Aww. I think every he's done everything except learn to talk. Should we go throw him out in the playpen? I don't think I own a playpen, do I? I don't think so. Oh, here's another tr little trick I like to do. Is that not part of my lot? Wow, this house has gotten really big. Because I used to have like a tent and everything out there, and I can't even fit a tent, the tent out there anymore. Wow. Am I going to be able to even put the playpen out here? I should be able to. I'll just have to move some stuff around. All right. Um, we got a gnome. <laughs> And unlike the gnomes in The Sims 4, they move around, which I kind of miss also. It's like everything I miss about The Sims 3 in 10 minutes or less. <laughs> um, let's see, what else? Do I, oh, yeah, I was going to put a playpen. You need to move out of the way. So we'll go get him a playpen, stick him out in the yard, as good parents do. We can also use Create a Style and color it if we wanted to. Plop. There we go. I don't... No, I don't think he learned how to talk. <clears throat> Let's see. Does he need anything? Nope. He good. So come... Are you emptying that? Come put your brother in the playpen. Put Nigel in the playpen. Alright, what is this? Something on the ground over here. Oh, it's his toy. Oh yeah, I got the dog of all, too. Looks like we got some bills. She can pay those while we're there. No, 
we not go here? Pay bills. Oh, okay, get mail. I don't know what the mail is, but we'll get it. You can hear the dishwasher way out there. What are you talking about, girl? Oh, we got a present. What is it? Got a gift in the mail from Kai. Got a gift? Oh. I was thinking about you and With thought you might call me. Dark. What did we get? Who's Kai? I don't remember who Kai is. We got some kind of poster. Yeah. We got that, like, movie poster thing. Woohoo! Money. <laughs> <clears throat> money, money, money. I don't remember who Kai is. Yeah, I thought... I think he is our dog. Unless we got a thing. Eloise wants to know if Alonzo would like to go on a date. Sure. Uh, Chorn. <laughs> Chorn Get him out of the house. I don't care. Um, who's Kai? Huh. Oh, it's this guy. Kai Kahail. I think he's married to somebody. I don't remember her name, though. I don't remember. Oh, I was... Is he gonna put him in? Oh, okay. I was like, where are you going with your brother? Why are you over there? The playband's over here. Okay. <laughs> Weirdo. Uh, that's the new boo. That's the new boo. Now you can learn to talk. What do you need to go eat or something? Why don't you get rid of that newspaper? Eh. Get rid of the newspaper. Do you need to do anything to your garden? Since they're dying for some reason? Alrighty then. She wants to chat with Zach. And she can magically... Or... Make house spotless. Yeah. Yeah, that. Do this up a few times so he'll do it more. All right. Um, did um, what's his bucket feed the bird? Yep, he fed him. And our little puppy. What does our puppy need? She's finding us some goodies. Ooh, Tanzanite, seventy-six. I wonder if we can send it to somebody and then let's put it in your pocket. Probably should have had um, the other guy do it. Yeah, get cut. Might be worth more if we get it cut. Um, I want that one that um, you put out in the yard and it just... Um, ugh, I didn't want to follow you. It just grows and grows. Okay. Just listen to bragging. You do that. You stay there and do that. I like to pause my game when I um, travel like that. Because um, I used to have issues where it would like mess it up, like crash or something. So It's been pretty good. I mean, I played Island Paradise the other day and it lagged. But Island Paradise always lags. Sorry, I'm messing with the camera. I'm trying to get it situated. I like it at a certain angle, and it, it doesn't do that angle, and it's like, mm -hmm. <laughs> It's frustrating. Are you learning to talk, little dude? Versa! That one died, too? <laughs> Get rid of it, then. Not this one, is it? No. What are you talking about? Looks like you need to harvest this. I thought I told you to harvest those, or did they grow again? What is she gonna do, or did she change her clothes? Uh, I don't understand why the plants are dying. She's taking care of them. Every day I have her, um, do stuff to them, so I don't understand why they're dying. Whatever. And look, she can make the bed. <laughs> That's cool. Upgrade fireproof. Yes, please. Yeah, because she has a pretty high handiness skill, right? No, it's not that high. It's only on four. It could be better. What's Mr. Zack up to? Hanging out in this chair. Why don't you go eat? What are you going to do? Leftovers? Oh, he's going to make some salad. Cool. Hey, at least he wouldn't burn the house down. 
That would have sucked if I told him to, um... If I told her to make it fireproof and then he decided to cook something before she made it fireproof and burn stuff. <clears throat> hey, but at least the fire department would have showed up. <laughs> and I have, I think I have ambitions turned off. I have, I didn't say you couldn't finish your salad. I have ambitions and... Um, World Adventures turned off. I think. I didn't see the point of turning off the, um, the stuff packs because they don't really do much. They're just mainly, like, objects. I figured turning off, like, expansion packs or whatever would really affect gameplay. I don't remember. Do I have music on? No, I don't think I have it. Yeah, I think they can hear it, but you can't hear it. <clears throat> bang, bang, bang. Because this is how you um, upgrade. This is how you upgrade your appliances. You beat on them with a hammer. <laughs> or I guess you could build, beat on them until they break and then buy a, a better one. So that's how you upgrade. <laughs> Alright, guys. That's all for this um, Sims 3 current household. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you want to see more, um, Sims 3 gameplay, let me know. I have, what do I have, three LPs going on in The Sims 4 right now. So, I may need to finish Baby Challenge or something like that before mm. I start a Sims 3 LP. Mm. Mm. But I could, like, keep doing, like, little current households or mm. create, I've been doing a couple of creative Sims, um... Mm. Maybe some builds or something like that. So those of you that have been playing Sims 4 and missed The Sims 3, or if you don't have The Sims 4 and you still only want to watch Sims 3 videos, then um, let me know. All right, guys. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.